sports bar, maybe with a little patio. Oh, Today yeah. would be a good day to, to check it, it out. Be really encouraging everybody to get outdoors today. And yeah, tonight, uh, go to your favorite spot with a patio and uh, or bar and watch the game on the big screen there. We're expecting a gorgeous afternoon and evening on the way. Uh, this morning, we are done with the rain here. We're starting out dry in Portland. Take a look at the coin tower camera uh, in downtown here. And you can see temperatures are also chilly. They're 39 degrees out in Portland. So uh, the last couple of mornings, we've been in the 50s, the upper 40s. This is a noticeably colder start out the door here. Notice temperatures all around the Portland metro area in the 30s. Hillsboro even starting out here at freezing. So bundle up today. I wasn't saying that earlier in the week here, but this morning you may want that heavy coat. Up to Vancouver sitting at 38 degrees. Milwaukee 37 this morning. You're stepping outside with the pets. Again, grab the jacket. We'll see a chilly morning and our temperatures through 8, 9 o'clock likely still in the 30s for most. Uh, so keep that in mind. But the afternoon we warm up by about midday. We're near 60 degrees this afternoon. Uh, low to mid 60s for our highs. So just a pleasant day to get out. Go enjoy the cherry blossoms and uh, get out for a walk there with the pups. Now check out this gang. Yesterday I had four animals in one picture. I think there are seven now. So this is Betty, Hannah, Augie, Dorky, Sunshine, Trudy and Scout. Yes, I do have a list that I'm reading from, but thank you, Donna out of Seaside for sharing this photo. Tomorrow, if you can beat seven pets, I will share your photo. So try and send that in to me at coin.com slash weather slash pet walk forecast. Yesterday was also nice. We did see some rain through the afternoon. 61 was our high yesterday. Normal highs should be in the upper 50. So we are running a little warmer than normal. Nothing unusual though, just some nice weather here as we uh, enter the next couple of afternoons. Also our observed rain so far over the month, we've seen just under three inches of rain. Notice normal totals here are close to three inches, so we're just about there. Great to see that after we've seen persistent drought the last several years here across the state and same for a number of months uh, again already this year and, and going into last year. So we would love to see the rain. We do expect to see more, although it may take until the weekend before we get to see some rain. So enjoy these next couple of days today. Notice our future cast this model doesn't bring in any rain. We're going to stay dry here uh, with a few clouds here and there. We'll keep it partly sunny today. Also Friday, we'll see a fully dry day. A chance for some rain showers finally rolling back in likely overnight. Friday into Saturday morning at some time. There is still some uncertainty on timing of this rain, but there is a system that is brewing offshore that uh, will start to roll in here going into the weekend. So Saturday right now around the morning afternoon time is most likely when we'll see some showers back in the picture. So keep that in your plans. A chance we get some showers going into our Saturday and also throughout Sunday. Now today we're still looking dry and pleasant for the coast today. Clouds decreasing after that morning fog starts to subside. We'll see a pleasant afternoon, low 60s and out in uh, Portland here, mid 60s. Temperatures around the valley also in the low to mid 60s. Just a great day uh, to get back outside. Quick look at our seven day forecast. Uh, we're expecting to see temperatures kind of staying in the 60s. Really not much change here. So pleasant weather, even though we'll track a few of those showers over the weekend, but really encouraging folks to get outdoors uh, through Friday. We'll, we'll see some beautiful afternoons on the way. And we do have the cherry blossoms out now. So they are in full bloom. It's beautiful down towards the waterfront. OK, yeah, I always have to remind you that uh, they don't stay blooming for very long. Yeah, right? So you have a weeks. couple of weeks yeah. to get down there and, and check it out. Yeah, yeah, the next couple days might be a good option. Yeah. Definitely. Thanks, Kelly. OK, let's take a quick check of the roads this morning.